Wow. Wow. <laughs> Everyone knows the guy's name. <laughs> like, honestly, like when you talk about Guelph and you talk about Griffin football, people just know Stu Lang. And I feel like that's the main reason you should be in the Hall of Fame. Like you can't talk about Griffin football without talking about Stu. When you think of anyone who's, who's had an impact on this football program, you have to think about Stu Lang. In the history of football, there's, there's been a few inflection points in, in our successes, and the day he, he arrived here, uh, his impact was felt, and this program is one of the best in Canada. Just look around, right? Uh, now, you gotta remember, when I started this, uh, you know, this flag thing, I was running on dirt. Um, if you look at this first class facility, including the track, now the weight room, the stadium, Langway, Lang Business School, like, I mean, so well deserving of it. Well, he, he, it's that, he's a builder. Uh, he builds, uh, he built this program up to levels that it would never been seen before. As a Guelph alumni player and coach uh, for all those years, you know, just to see what, where Guelph is now because of Stu's generosity, is amazing. But in addition to the physical aspect of what Stu's built, he's, he's, he's built the culture. He's had a big impact on the people. And I think that's where the build is in addition to the physical aspect. He's, he's made us all better and made us all want to achieve as close as we can to, to excellence. And, and along the lines, we get that, that aspect of greatness that he's, he was always talking about. He completely changed the team. Um, when he came in, and then obviously what you're looking at now with all of our new facilities, you literally have a hub here that Stu's created that's able to better the players and create a better atmosphere for players and just what Stu's brought. Stu's relationship with the players, you know, it's pretty special. It is pretty special. I mean, as a football coach, it's X's and O's, it's practice planning, it's recruiting. But those players that play for the Griffins, when they played those seasons, they were, they were Stu's guys. Stu had a lot of integrity. They, they knew deep down that it was a real special coach-player relationship as our head coach. And they, our players, they ran, they would run through the wall for Stu. I remember in like some of our captain's meetings, he would literally just sit down and be like, what can I do for you guys to make you better? Whatever you guys need, let me know. If this will actually help you, you'll have it. And he was just amazing that way. And like, he would always, it wasn't just football based, like he would check in with you, ask how you're doing. He's just a selfless human, like I, I don't know how else to describe him. And I try to bring that with me, just kind of try to relate to how he is, not just thinking about yourself, but thinking about how you can impact other people. And I feel like that's how he's always operated. Stu's vision of making this a football program is more than just the X's and O's. Teams have coaches and players and they play games and they script it, but programs have many people that are around. We put effort into our marketing, so we have a marketing team. Uh, we have a recruiting team. Our parents, you know, there's 200 of them. You know, we gave them a role and uh, they have the best tailgates in, in Canada. And that's because of Stu and his support. So he, he puts a lot of importance on the other aspects of the program, which make us better. And I think his ability to bring in that family atmosphere and, and just, Stu just, uh, to me, he leads by example. You know, it takes a village to raise a, a family and, and uh, that's what this was. It's very important that Stu stays involved with this football program because his vision is ongoing. It's, it's not done. When he stopped coaching, the book didn't end and he's still writing the book. So it's so important that he is here with us to guide us along each chapter. Um, and uh, as I said before, he, he really tries to get other people to be part of the story writing. And that's what's so special about Stu. He empowers people uh, to be part of it. And uh, he wants to see it. I don't even know if the book will ever end, to be honest, because that's what legacies are about.